Oh, okay, so this is winner's finals? I actually don't know that much about how this matchup plays out. Meta Knight, Ivysaur. It's got to be interesting, though. It is. Ivysaur doesn't have any projectiles at all, so he's going to have to be forced to approach Ivysaur. Or Wait, you Meta mean uh, Meta Knight? Meta Knight yeah. has no projectiles, so he's going to be forced to approach Ivysaur. Um, and we've seen that Fraud really gets a lot of uh, follow-ups from his... Uh, his projectile, his uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, razor leaf he's into great grab. At, he's great at following up both of his projectiles. Without a doubt. Hmm, I'm thinking not Yoshi's. He has some like he has some sick confirms off of the nair too. Like I, I see a lot of people they'll just nair for a percent or whatever. But he actually seems to use it to like actually set up combos. Which oh I yeah, yeah. He gets. Very much. Dude, he, I mean, I know it's possible, but he I just gets don't a lot of grabs of off of like. Anytime he does an aerial, he'll get a grab off of it. Yeah, sure. which is really, it's a huge part of obviously his game. Mm -hmm. And his pummel's healing, dude. Like, that's yeah. crazy. And they built, I think they built Solar Beam as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so Ivysaur Meta Knight. No hand warmers this game, thankfully. Um, wow, gets the poison on him. Yeah, those little flowers are nasty. They do like 6 7%. Yeah, I, it depends on how uh, strong the sweet spot is. Like, uh... I think if you actually get the sweet spot on it, it's a uh, more damaging flower. Okay. I might be wrong about that, but I'm pretty sure that's how it works. I know sometimes I see the percentage tick up faster than others. Ivysaur has a lot of very unique mechanics in this game. Oh, th throws him off stage. Almost kills him with a back throw. Bear? Oh. Dude, I can drive you Enterprise. I mean, it, it's easier. What, what time? Oh, another sweet spot up there. As soon as you, okay. I mean, if you need, and if you need me to leave early to take you up there, I can. All right. Okay, so uh, even stocks, three stocks apiece, zero percent. Uh, Ivy Sword does have the fully charged uh, solar beam though. Already, so. yeah. And it looks like Saren, too, is having trouble getting in on these projectiles. Really, man? His his space... Dude, that, that's the thing. Like, when you play other fighters and you switch to PM or melee, you really do just have a lot of good experience. You have your spacing. You have your timing. You have your movement. You have your zoning tools. Yeah, I don't think yeah. it's a coincidence that Jed is also a Dalsum player in Street Fighter. Right. Oh, like the makes, way he's spacing okay. These. Everything makes perfect sense now. Dude, yeah, this kid... He's essentially playing the, the Dalsum equivalent in this game. Like, he's even got the, the stretch hitboxes. He's got the projectiles. It's, oh, yeah. Yeah, it's totally... Yeah, I can definitely see it now. Okay. Oh, wow. And, uh, wow, that would have definitely been a sweet spot had he Did not blocked it. you see how much shield stone was on yeah, that as well? Just it's like, really heavy. It's, okay. it's like uh, Lucas's Ford Smash. It's about a the good, same amount of shield stone. Probably 40 frames of shield stone yeah. just from that one move. Let's see. Oh. Saren is really good at gimping the uh, tether recoveries, though. Yeah, I've he's noticed. really good on the ledge, period. He just uh, drops down with Meta Knight, nares, and... Knocks him off completely. See, he's being very careful. Oh, see, oh that power shield razor leaf. He wow. is making sure not to get hit by razor leaf because that's how uh, Jed gets most of his uh, follow-ups. See so. what he follows up with on this throw here. Took the nair and then he's going to grab the ledge. I wonder what he's going to do. Uh, a little bit of an up tilt and then the shuttle wow, for the kill. The okay, okay. So Saren takes a comfortable lead, I would say, yeah. uh, now. Uh, definitely. Yeah, he's, he's figured the projectile game out. Now Seems. he's he's forcing Ivysaur to approach him because he's uh, he's so far behind, which ooh, really puts him at a disadvantage. Oh. I thought Gosh. we were about to take another ride off the top there I for a second. Well. Oh, let's see what he gets here. There's been a lot of oh, kills. Oh, okay. wow, the down air. There's been a lot of kills off the top tonight, for sure. See, so Crouch canceled his Razor Leaf that time, actually, and just down tilted. Yep. Okay. Gets a follow up. Oh, nice grab there. Uh, I figured he would go for the up smash. You know what? I think, think Saren is just being a little less predictable than Nick was about his uh, options, which is why he's not getting hit with the uh, Vine Whip sweet spot so often. Yeah, I mean. Especially if uh, you have a like a if you start to notice like a tech habit or someone oh yeah you uh, on just someone put it there. yeah you just put it there and it usually is gonna work okay so Saren and it, it's it's different too from a lot of characters that are like hard read characters like let's say a Falcon or something like that where you can cover the option but you have to actually be in that spot to cover it yeah the but range so is so away. long on that Vine Whip that yeah. like yeah it's punishable up close but if you just go for the hard read on a tech then. You either get it or you don't, but you're fine. You're, you're still in you're neutral. Safe. It's a very, very safe option compared to uh, most like platform tech options where you really do just yeah, have to be there. Yeah, something like opposed to like a hard knee or something. Like just going for a hard read knee. Mm. 
All right, so they go to Smashville for game two. I think that's a really good option for both characters, really. But I guess Ivy Shore's going to try and make use of the platform, maybe get away and heal if he yeah. uh, starts feeling pressure. Yeah, I, I think it just really gives, like, it seems to me like the, uh, uh oh, got a bit of a combo developing here. And it looks like Saren is just really establishing dominance early in this game. Oh, absolutely. Just made sure he didn't have a jump back here to Dylan. Yeah, I think he just uh, he got what he needed to in that first game. You know, downloaded the projectile game a little bit. And yeah, now he's yeah. just making the adaptations and executing it. It's, it has given him results. Let's see what he does on the ledge here. I really thought he had that down here. The obvious door. See? Yep, fraud. Oh, uh, this is the misses. sweet spot, though. That is what happens when you hit the vine whip, miss. but don't sweet spot. Yep, it's a very light hit, and it's punishable. See, he shielded the razor leaf, got a grab. If he hits you with a razor leaf, he knows so many follow-ups to get just off of that. So, yeah, Sarah needs to make sure he's not getting hit by the razor leaf. Hmm. Saren goes for the drill. It's not punished, though. Misses the grab. Oh, and we got Fraud hanging. Trying to take center stage here, but just getting torn apart by the Meta Knight pressure. Definitely. Wow. All right, his Solar Beam is starting to charge a little bit, so that might be some benefit, but he's going to have to think of some different approach options to get in on Saren. Yeah, for sure. Could start trying some, like, uh, some down B mind games or something like that. Just trying to throw more projectiles out there. Yeah. The down B, if you use it, like, you can, like, short hop and use it fairly laglessly, but... Throwing some aerials out, just trying to get a kill move, a strong move. Back air, there we go. But see, Saren's just throwing out aerials, pressuring him off the stage, and Saren's taking center stage, so Ivysaur can't get any momentum started. Yeah. Oh, did you see that? He that shuttle, shuttle canceled, canceled yeah. it. Yeah. That was awesome. That was crazy. Man, this guy really is technical. I know uh, most people say PM, you know, it's really not that uh, that hard of a game, but you really can get take some time and uh, develop some tech skill with it for sure. Yeah, no, there are, I think there are definitely really technical aspects of the game. It all just depends on what character you're playing. Definitely. Wow, almost kills him with that I mean, back throw. The oh. same, the same really could be said for melee though. I mean, it is the game in it, or melee is in, inherently more technical. But wow, yo, let's freaking go, bro! Yeah, oh my sick. gosh! That down air was. All right, sick. so brings it. Oh man! Oh. All right, all right, we'll take it. We'll take it. Got the fully charged solar beam. One stock up. Got a little percent. All right, getting a throw. All right. Back throw. Let's see what Saren can do to recover some of this lost momentum. If he yeah. gets a clean back air right here, it'll probably be a kill. I don't know. True, he really no, did. He, he just sapped all of his momentum with that down air, and then Saren just SD'd and lost his rhythm. Yep. Saren, if anyone is capable of making this comeback, though, it is Saren. It is. It definitely is. Meta Knight's a really strong character, and Saren's a yeah, really good player. Yeah, he's a very very clutch player, too. Uh, absolutely. I would use that word. He's a, he's a melee falcon. He's got that falcon oh, blood. Definitely. All right, so... Jed's just try oh, trying oh, to get some stage wow. control. He keeps his solar beam after he dies, though. Oh, oh no. Tries to go for a hard though. read, yeah. Yeah. Um, he could still he could still do this, for sure, without a doubt. It's just uh, Almost Saren's got really that little up air carry on the forward air. Gosh, Saren's really bringing this back super fast. Yeah, he is. Oh, oh no. The up beast Okay, spot. okay. Still living, though. Good DI. Not that it would have killed around 70 anyway, but... By the way, I think I figured out what you were... I'll tell you in a minute. All right, so yeah, looks like looks like Saren has managed to uh, manage to establish dominance again. He's definitely looking like he can take this. It's a very even game right now. I mean, three percent away. Oh, and he gets a yo. He gets the projectile. Is this it? Oh. Nice, yo. And that's what Von Web. Oh my gosh. Okay, game three. Uh. I want to say winners, winners something. Yeah, this is winners. Yeah, final. dude. Yeah, for for sure. What? Hey, what time is it actually? Like 10? 10? 15. Okay. All right. So, uh, really quick, just want to want to shout out again, like uh, the guys at one of. I mean, it's 10:15, and they're hanging out with us, so we can finish this uh, this bracket real fast. Like, yep. They really uh, they put on an amazing tournament today. 
Uh, and it was just, it was a lot of fun. So if you're anywhere near Dothan, come out. Because uh, how often do you guys plan on doing these? Uh, yeah. These particular events, it's kind of sporadic. Okay, I mean, just a few times a year. But, I mean, there's a lot of guys in Dothan that are just uh, willing to play. And every, yeah, every Friday, uh, they, yeah, the there's a group nights. up here to play up here. The fight, the, yeah. yeah. So you can, uh, if you want, you can just come up on a Friday night, play. They don't play for money on Friday night, but I mean, if you want a money match, some kids. <laughs> All right, so. Got to get those money matches in. Love money Ooh, matches. nice down air there. All right, so. Oh, he's wow. going off. Oh, get him with a really good juggle, a 50% combo. That's not bad. Oh, did you see the way he just, like, swings yeah, with his, uh. It's always so strange watching the, the vine physics of him just swinging there. 69%. Maybe he can make some of the magic happen. Okay. Uh oh. Pops him. Didn't really get anything off the razor lead for any of the, the neutrals that followed, but may be able to get back on stage here and establish Oh man, Saren SD is okay. Unfortunate SD. Yeah, I really still think that. Uh, that uh, random up air spike the Jed got in the last game still sapped his momentum. You know, he may still yeah. be suffering from that to some extent. Doesn't look like he's suffering too much. No, it's a uh, 1-1, one, one, three stocks apiece. Very, very even game. Two great players. I mean, this is about as, uh, about, about as close as it could really get. Meta Knight starts to juggle. Oh, no. Just forward smashes him right off the ledge like that. Nice down air stalls to recover. Definitely. All right, he's really fighting for stage control here, but Saren is just not giving it to him. Yeah, Saren wants that ledge. Makes That's it back, ledge. but he's still taking percent, so oh, yeah. he just moved ledges, really. Yep. I mean, that's how it is when you when you have that that percent advantage on someone. Unless they can give it a little turnaround like this, like you're seeing right now. I mean, you can pretty much just bop them back and forth from uh, from one ledge to the other, and if they're high percent, they're going to be struggling just to hang on, forget get stage control. Definitely. Back throws them off. He throws out a razor leaf. Oh, tries to go for the gimp, but he decides to go over the razor leaf with his uh, with his. Up e, so. Oh! Oh, very nice down air spike. And I think Saren okay. was really close to grabbing yeah, the he, ledge he there. He off really, that. that was a good recovery by Saren. He surprised. almost made it. Yeah. Mm, going for some risky stuff on the ledge there. Yeah, I mean. I'm surprised Saren didn't decide to go out and punish that. Oh, no. Oh, that's okay. Okay. He's got a little 8%. That's a, roughly a hit. So maybe he can get something started just with that little bit of momentum. Um. You know, some projectiles. really speaks to uh, Fraud's like confidence as a player in his projectile and spacing game. He's comfortable playing so close to the ledge. I guess it probably does come with uh, playing a tether character. Too I was gonna say well. his recovery he, he is just so really, safe. Yeah, he does have really good recovery, but he's just so confident. He, he just puts himself out there and he's like, "Hey, look, shuttle loop off the top." Hey, look, All I'm right. gonna get shuttle looped. Looking That's good. What he said. All right, so Saren's got to lead. This is game three. So if Jed wants to bring this back, he's got to make something happen really quick. Okay, he's getting some momentum. All right, Saren's on the ledge, trying to recover. Oh, misses the upbeat. Goes with the hard to put the mana with him. Yeah. This is it. Our bat throw off Sage, so he's got the advantage at the moment. Yeah. Oh. Nice court air. Yeah, he's trying. He definitely wants the vine whip. That's for sure. Oh man. I think Saren just has the DI for the vine whip figured out though. Yeah. Oh man, he gets him with that off stage again. Uh -oh. All That's right. Rough. Game three, last stock. Let's. Flip and go. Winner's finals. All right. He has the solar beam, too. He does so have the solar Saren beam. Really needs, to, really needs to take this right here if he can. All right. Once again, using the pl uh, the projectiles to get in. He's only him a bit. He's trying to find a grab so he can get a uh, solar beam combo. Oh, nice. He power shielded another razor leaf and followed up on it. That's really hard. That's really yeah, hard that's, timing. Yeah, that's a really timing intensive uh, thing to do. Let's guard situation. <laughs> Both players just playing very patiently. Definitely. Nice forward air. Staring with the dash attack. It's a, knocks him off stage again. You know, Meta Knight's dash attack is pretty good. Yeah, it is. It really is. Okay, this is where... Ooh. Oh, the back air. He really needs to get something started there. there. Uh, okay, nares him. Up. He gets nared himself. Oh, falls uh, in with a back air and takes yep. the game. All right, good stuff to Saren. Those back airs.
continuing his dominance, man. This this guy better not win melee as well as PM today. You know, he is very likely to do it. Yeah, he, he, he really he goes, definitely could. He definitely goes head to head with some of the best uh, players in the state in both games. Now that was uh that was winners finals for PM. So we uh there, dude. He was like, he was like, okay, I know he's gonna approach with Razor Leaf, and I'm just not gonna get hit by it. Like, he was like, I'm not gonna shield it, I'm not gonna get hit by it, and you were like, I don't know how to hit it. And uh, I can already tell I'm getting a little yeah. tired, so I'm actually gonna yeah. gonna jump off commentary. I'm gonna let Saren hop on here for a minute. All right, so dude. You guys can say what up to him. Heck yeah, I get to hang out with the champ for a second. Still Sounds talking good. to your stream, keep it real, guys. All right, so I guess Saren's gonna join me for commentary for some of our uh, losers bracket matches. Ugh. They're, they're about to call somebody in just a second, I believe. Good stuff, man. That was that was really good. Like first game, he was uh, he was getting you with the razor leaf, but yeah, you definitely figured that matchup out pretty quickly. So it wasn't so much as him, me learning the matchup. It was more him adjusting to what I was doing. So really, I, I kept doing repetitive things and he kept punishing me for it. So okay. I decided to mix up a little bit. Yeah, I was noticing he didn't hit you with very many, if any, of his uh, sweet spot upbees. Like, and because, he was getting those on. Uh, because I was watching him in prior matches and I noticed that he was going for it a lot, so I figured I might as well just land. Yeah, it's a uh, low risk situation for me, so I figured I might as well not jump for it for because sure. Because that's how he's that's how he's been catching most of his opponents. Yeah, so and he was uh, you didn't miss any techs on platforms, which I saw Nick was missing a lot, and he was just getting that every single time, but because you, I. In certain situations for IBC, where you know if he gets you with the neutral area, he might get you with the follow-up down tilt. Definitely. And if you don't take that, he's going to make you eat more damage and potentially make you eat a down air. Yeah. A sweet spot down air. For sure. 